Hey everyone, welcome back. In today's quick tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a simple but stylish dot pattern in Figma. Whether you're working on a website background, a UI accent, or just want to add a bit of texture to your designs, this Figma trick will let you produce custom dotted lines that look sharp and professional. By the end, you'll know exactly how to make and reuse these dot patterns with confidence. So let's get started. All right, first things first, open up Figma and hop into the file where you want to create your dot pattern. If you're brand new to Figma, don't worry, this is super beginner friendly. I'm working on a blank canvas, but you can do this on top of any design. The key is making sure you've got a clear space to draw our pattern. Next, look for the pen tool. You can find it on the left hand toolbar. It looks like the tip of a fountain pen, or you could just hit the P key as a shortcut. This tool is perfect for drawing lines that aren't just straight edges. Instead, we're going to use it to draw a curve. Click once on your canvas to set the starting point of the line and then click again for the end point. But before you release that second click, drag your mouse to curve the line to your liking. Don't stress too much about getting the curve exactly right on the first try. Figma lets you adjust it afterward by dragging the little handles. Think of this like drawing a gentle wave or a hill. This will help your dot pattern look a little more dynamic compared to a simple straight line. Once your curve is looking good, go ahead and select it by clicking on the line. This is where some magic happens. At the top of the Figma window, you'll see a section called Stroke, and right next to it is a little icon for advanced stroke settings. Click on that to open up the full menu. Now by default, your line is probably a solid stroke, but we want to turn it into dots, so find the section labeled Style and switch Solid to Dashed. When you do this, you'll see new input fields pop up for dash and gap. Here's the trick, if you set the dash value to 0 and the gap to something like 8, all of those dashes collapse down into tiny dots. You can play with those numbers to change the size and spacing of your dots until it looks just right for your project. Take a moment to check it out on your canvas. If your dots seem too big or too close together, don't worry, you can always adjust the dash and gap values again. And remember, you can change the stroke color, weight, or even make the dots transparent for different effects. It's all up to you. Now to build out your pattern, all we need to do is duplicate this dotted line. Just select the line you just made, hit Command or Control plus D, and Figma will instantly make a copy for you. You can drag the copy around, stack versions on top of each other, or rotate and arrange them to form a full dot grid or a flowing, decorative matrix. This is where you get to play around and really make the pattern fit your design. And there you have it, a fast, flexible way to create custom dot patterns right inside Figma. Take another look at your canvas, maybe tweak a few settings and see how this pattern could fit into your next design. If you miss a step, don't stress, just rewind and go through it again. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to hit like, leave a comment below if you have any questions or want more Figma tricks, and make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out on future videos. Thanks for watching and happy designing!